What is going on internet? It is Capital J Productions. I'm back with another video. And today we're talking about Drake painting his fingernails. Okay, we gotta react to that. So here's the video. I'm gonna give you my reaction to it. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see it, but his fingernails are painted pink. Okay, he got the rainbow uh, colored iced out watch. Okay, we'll talk about that in a bit. Let's continue on. Yep, pink nails. And those is uh, his pink nails. Okay. So uh, let's look at it uh, one more time. Actually, I'll start breaking it down now, okay? Once it starts over. Okay, um, I think you guys seen enough. Um, and I always leave links to these, um, these videos and stuff so you guys can check it out for yourself. But as far as me and how I see this now, when I first heard of Drake, right? I like Drake. I like Drake more as a rapper than than him trying to sing. Um, I like that version of um, Drake. I don't really like singer Drake too much. Um, but uh, anyway, that's personal stuff. Um, the nails, okay? Now, he's been out for a very long time, okay? He's been out for a very long time. And now, out of all this time, that goes by now he wants to he just so happens to paint his fingernails right now I remember um I don't know which video I'm gonna put out first um but uh, I was just saying this um and um because I did the the little babies uh I did that video first uh but like it like I said in that video hip-hop is 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 um they're they're on a a fast pace to to uh promote men to be gay or men to be more feminine so you're gonna see more and more stuff like this like you're gonna see you know the the, the finger painting you're gonna you're gonna start seeing more and more stuff you're gonna you you know wigs pretty soon it's just gonna be trans rappers you know what i'm saying like like male rappers that's that's just that got makeup on everything. I believe that's going to come uh, within the next couple of years or so. But yeah, um, do I think Drake is gay? You never know, you know what I'm saying? You never know who's gay, you never know who's straight. And you know, they always try to, you know. See, what people don't understand is, is that in this rap game, in this in this rap world, in that game, it's an evil game. Okay, like it, it's been evil, and nobody is exempt. Not even Drake. Okay, the people who control this industry, they don't care about who you are. They don't care about like, you know, how big you are, or because they made you. Okay, they made you popular. They made you popping, and they can end you. At any time, anytime you won't do what they want you to do, they will end you. Okay, these these are the people, and this is why you see people like Drake, who's doing this now, which is like he's been out since like what 2001, I think, uh, something like that, 2011 maybe. He's been big for a very long time. Okay, and now all of a sudden he's promoting the same other stuff that uh, all these other rappers are promoting. Rappers like Young Thug who who wore dresses and you know what I mean and uh, little Uzi Vert he remember he he paints his fingernails and he do all of this weird stuff. Now you got Drake, you got little baby, you got you see what I'm saying. You see the the road I'm going is more and more of these masculine looking guys that are becoming. They're trying to they're trying to um, persuade. The masculine men to become like them and this is this is it's not gonna work you know what i'm saying like you guys can put out whoever you guys want to put out and 
you know what I'm saying, and, and try to persuade us. But this is like to real masculine men, we we won't we won't do this type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm, you know, I'm not about to sit up here and paint my fingernails. You know what I'm saying? Like I think it's I think it's I think the only exception that's uh, that a man can get away with doing it is if he have like a little daughter and his daughter is painting his nails for it because she just you know she's just a kid and you know she she knows about like womanhood and how they they paint nails i think you could do that but like you know because i would like if, if if i had a little daughter and you know what i mean and she wanted to paint my nails i would let her paint my nails but i'm not about to be posting it on no social media or anything you know what i'm saying I, of course i'll let her do it but i would let her know like this is not for daddies you know that's what you have your mommy for you know what i mean you you and your mommy can do that for but it's like with these guys here, right? It's almost like they're trying to take over the mother's role. Like eventually it's like, and well, it's like they're trying to push out the woman slowly but surely. But um, yeah, it's, it's this stuff is deep, man. And I can go on for uh, forever about this because this game, you know what I mean? Like it, 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 it's it's more than the game like these people are serious and they're really seriously promoting these rappers to to be more feminine you know and uh this is why i always say you can't look up to nobody you should be looking up to yourself you know what i mean like inspired you know we we need to we need to be promoting that more than anything because you know god didn't make all of us to be moving this in this all in the same direction you know what i'm saying like you know he made us different for a reason so we can we can all can be uniquely ourselves okay but let me go ahead and uh let me try to break this down so i can end this video okay yeah i want to i want to comment about this watch because it's not just it just so happened to be a rainbow watch, okay? And you guys should y'all already know what the rainbow stands for, okay? Uh the, of course the rainbow, the rainbow was a real it's a it's really God's rainbow and they took it and trying to make it their own, you know, their own version of uh the LGBT community, you know what I'm saying? So you obviously see why he's doing this, right? So, I mean, and you know what? Now that I think about it, I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of these rappers are gay from the get go. Like, I would not be surprised if the, the, the music industry is picking gay, gay males that pretend to be straight for a certain amount of years. And when and when the people on top says, OK, it is your time now. Start now. Let's start showing Start showing what you do behind the scenes. Start doing it now. I would not be surprised if that's was uh, is that what the music industry is doing on purpose. And they having these these uh, these gay males act straight until it's a certain amount of time, and then they come out of the closet. Okay. Yeah, see, pink nails. It's ridiculous, you know. What I mean, like that's that's just stupid, you know. Um, but yeah, you guys gotta stay woke, you know. Y'all gotta stay aware to what's going on, cause uh, they're trying to persuade you, you know. What I mean, and you should do something because you want to do it, not because like Drake or some artist that you look up to or entertainer you look up to did it. You should never like. Like me, I don't have no tattoos. I don't have like I'm I'm the plainest type of guy you probably ever. Eat. I don't have no piercings. I don't have. I don't let nobody persuade me to do anything that I don't want to do. Period. You know I I never really smoked weed. You know what I mean back back in the like '90s where everybody was doing it in high school. Everybody was doing it. I wasn't doing it. You know what I'm saying I always was me. And you know what I mean? And um, I didn't care who liked it or who didn't like it. You know what I'm saying? I will fight you to death. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're not going to 
you're not going to push me in no direction that I don't want to go. You know what I'm saying? And that that goes for everybody. And as much as I love hip hop, as much as I love rap, I won't let no rapper do it. I won't let no music do it. I won't let nobody do it. I only would do I only would change for God. And that's it. I won't change for nobody else. And I think that's how we should be as people. Only you only change for. You know, for um, for yourself, for your God or or, or for um, for the most important people in your life who deserve it and people who, you know, only want was better and not really just to control you, you know, for their benefit. So I hope you guys understand what I'm saying, because I mean, look at look what Drake is. He's tr he's obviously putting it out there for like, why are you putting it out there for bro? Like. You know, you waited all this time and now you're putting this out here because he's, in my opinion, he's trying to persuade people, you know, you know, but um, that's what I think. I would not be surprised if, um, if Drake is gay. Um, I would not be surprised if um, I, I actually expect more to come out with, you know, it's, it's a lot more is being revealed. A lot of truth is being revealed right now in this time frame in this world. And um, a lot of the truth about the rap game is really coming out, you know, and um, but yeah, I mean, I guess I want you guys opinion about this. Do y'all think um, Drake is gay? Do y'all think he's he's part of the LGBT? Um, I do. I believe so. You know, I believe so. He has the he has the rainbow watch, the rainbow iced out watch. Um, he got his fingernails painted. You know, I think he always have been good, you know, down that road with those people. And uh, yeah, so um, that's what I think. But I'm interested in what you guys think. Um, what you know, just let me know what you guys think. Do y'all think he's just doing this just to just to get uh, just to sell more records? You know, I mean, Drake has been doing great all these years. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't think he needs to stoop to this level, but he did. Um, but it's all about money in their world. It's all about trying to become bigger and bigger, bigger and bigger. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I got to say. Um, you guys let me know in the comments of what you think. This is Capital J Productions. I'll be back with another video within uh, another day or two. Y'all have a blessed one. Peace.